Hi everyone! Welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel and today I am very excited because I have one of my and probably your favorite quarterly lifestyle boxes that I opened here on the channel. It has been sent to me for review and it is of course the Willow Nook box that just comes in whatever box works for the goodies that she has inside. I think Carissa does an amazing job every single quarter and the value of this box is always really good. The fall and winter boxes are usually my favorites because they definitely have a sense of hygge, a sense of coziness to them. The box is just $99 per quarter. That does include the shipping, which I think, again, is a smoking deal. I think that my codes still work. I'll try to check with her before this posts. But before, I had a code for $10 off that was Noel 10 And then I also had a code that was for 20% off in the shop because she does have a shop aside from the subscription box. And that was Noel 20 for 20% off but I'll put all of those codes and links for you, of course, in the description box below. But let me just give you a little uh, rundown of what the box is all about. This is probably an older description, but just in case it's one of the first times that you're seeing it here on the channel. The Willow Nook box is a seasonal gift subscription that brightens up your home. You will receive at least five items plus a new recipe print with original artwork. That's one of the really cool and very unique features about this box that I love so much. And you, as a member, as a subscriber of the box, can actually submit your recipes and then they can be created into these beautiful pieces of art uh, and you could frame them in your kitchen for whatever season it happens to be. They're really, really lovely. I think it's neat. So your box will contain a variety of home goods, decor, self-care items, bath and body products at and more. At Willow Nook, we're passionate about supporting artists and creators in our community. At least one item in every box will be handmade and sourced directly from a small scale artisan. So love that as well. Let me go ahead and put this box down here beside me so that I can get into it and we will see all of our goodies inside. I'm so, so excited. By the way, you guys, if you haven't already, I have kind of announced it over in my live stream. We usually do live streams once a month, except we skip the summer months. So we just started them back up, but we will be doing our own what we call Nobody Awards. We did it last year where we just try to recognize some of the boxes that we really enjoy, whether we're subscribers or we're, we're admirers from afar. And I can tell you that Willow Nook Box will probably be one of the nominees in a couple of categories. So we have this little uh, kind of guide to our box here. It says your fall box is here. And I just kind of love that she has this sort of setup for you. It says how to open this box, prepare your favorite drink, put on your favorite music, settle into your nook, take a deep breath, open your willow nook box, cozy up and get creative. And of course, I also sort of love it because our private Facebook group for the channel is called the Nobot Nook. So I love any, anything that's got like a nook vibe to it. So inside we have a message from her and some highlights of a couple of the products. There is a whole list of the products. So you know, in that description, I said, you know, there's at least five products. Let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 items in this box, you guys. Again, fantastic value and also great for regifting a couple of the items and keeping a few for yourself so you don't have to feel like you're being selfish. I like to keep everything for myself. It says, hello, dear friend. Autumn is here and already seems to be flying by. Fall is such a lovely season in New York, but it's always such a busy time. Between the abrupt end of summer and the start of the big holiday season, it feels like there's a small window of time to partake in so many wonderful activities. As I'm writing this, I have yet to switch out my clothes, even though I know I'm not wearing shorts again this year. Despite the weather getting colder, fall is all about warmth. Warm colors, warm treats, warm activities. Fall outdoor activities always involve movement and conclusion include a, with a hot cider or soup. We embrace the cold because it allows us to feel comfort in the things that make us warm, like a light in the dark. This box is all about touch and texture. As you take each item out, take a moment to feel it in your hands and think about what that sensation evokes. I've also included quite a few extras in this box so that you have everything you need to start using your items right away. I sincerely hope that you love your Fall Willow Nook box. You guys, you have to get in on this. That's so, so cool. Some really, really neat items. Awesome. Okay, so let me just put this off to the side so I make sure I get everything. We have some nice tissue paper, a little sticker in there, and then I'm gonna have to try to maybe not have the box get me right in the neck like it just did. <laughs> that, was, that was tricky. All right, let's see what we've got. Okay, oh my goodness, there's a lot in here. So let me show you. You can kind of see I'm getting smacked by the box again. All right, I think that's the last time I'm gonna pick up the box so that I don't uh, 
get decapitated here. <laughs> Maybe I'll pull some of the contents out so that it's a little bit easier. So we do have so much inside though. I want to make sure that I don't miss anything. Oh my goodness. There's some really sweet things. You guys, I'm very excited about this, but there's a lot like, like a lot, a lot. Okay. I see our art print, which I'm very excited about. Oh my gosh, look at this cute little extra pumpkin. It's a little fabric pumpkin. You guys know I collect pumpkins. I don't know what to do in terms of my storage though. That's one of the things that I always say is I love, I love home decor and I love seasonal decorating, but I just don't have room in my house for a lot of it. And then the thing is because it's when it's seasonal, like really seasonal, like pumpkins, I have to put it away. And I just, I, I've kind of, I'm at, up to here with boxes in my garage so you guys if you have any suggestions let me know i don't want to have to take out a storage space just for all of my holiday decor every season all right let's see what we have got so the first thing i want to start with is this i'm very excited about this and she took some lovely photos of the items in this box over on their instagram account too so this is a wooden recipe stand very very cool very chic it kind of looks like a cutting board but it's not a cutting board it's actually very light but it has a beautiful grain to it so it just has this little you know just like a picture frame but it looks like a cutting board but it's almost like almost like balsa wood it feel like it's very very lightweight so prop up your tablet cookbook or recipe card with convenience and style and it's just got this little uh spot where you can of course put your your books in there and so you could have the book open of course and then you could also use this i love this because i've been wanting like a nice frame uh, to display these beautiful uh, recipe cards that she does by the way this uh, wooden recipe stand has a $36 value sorry it keeps clapping on the back but look how pretty that is and then here is you guys this recipe looks amazing so let me put this off to the side it is for pumpkin cinnamon rolls and then look at how gorgeous that is so it did come in a nice uh, sleeve but you make it look like a pumpkin with this drizzle and then probably like a cinnamon stick there for the top so she actually has a beautiful picture here um, and you can see them it says these pumpkin cinnamon rolls are dangerously good and my new fall favorite the first time I made them I didn't have time to add the icing and they were just as incredible without it while this recipe is a little time consuming it is not at all difficult it's also a great introduction to making cinnamon rolls if you've never tried it before and it looks like this one did not come from a subscriber but rather from a cookbook and she does uh, tell us about it it's called the farmer's daughter so uh, there's a little little nod to the farmer's daughter, the cookbook. And then here is a gorgeous picture of someone who actually made those pumpkin cinnamon rolls. How cool is that? I think that looks amazing. And I just, again, love the artwork. I think that's really neat and inspiring, right? So what? How, it would be really fun to make these and then take the photos with the pumpkin card in the back. All right, let's keep going though. We also have, and this was kind of cradling some of our items, so let me get those items out of the way. Very excited. This is so beautiful. It is a water hyacinth basket tray. Let me just get, there's a little bit of styrofoam or packing materials on here. So it's so cute. Oh, how cute. Look at how beautiful this tray is. And then we've got these little little acorns that were sitting in there. I think those are extras. Look at this beautiful tray. So beautiful for your bathroom as a catch-all in your entryway. It has just a little bit of depth, but I love the big chunky weave to it. Kind of reminds me of like a big chunky sweater or something. So this has a $15 value. And then I don't even see these little felted acorns on there, but look how adorable those are. And she just had them like draped like that. But those are so cute. Oh my gosh, I love, like now I'm sort of starting to be obsessed with acorns. For a while it was like pine cones and pumpkins. And now it's like, I love the acorns, but I love little felted things. They have such a sense of coziness to them. I really, really like that. So that is our water hyacinth basket tray. Then it looks like we also have, let's see, there's so much stuff in here. I have to make sure I got everything out. All right. Then it says that there's an herb and flower drying rack. Now I haven't seen that in here, so I'm not sure where that is or what that looks like. So I'll have to have to keep looking for it, but let's keep going. So then we also have this cotton knit trivet uh, slash pot holder. Oh my gosh. Speaking of a chunky weave, look how fantastic that is. This has an $8 value. I feel like that is really, really reasonable. It's from Danica heirloom. So of course I like it. Look how thick that is. So you could definitely use it as a trivet. 
um, if you're presenting your delicious pumpkin cinnamon rolls uh, or you know for a pie or any anything that's going on your dining table or on your TV tray like I'd like to do but you could also use it as a pot holder because it's nice and thick it's got a little loop right here that's fantastic I love that it's just nice neutral and then of course we have some I'm trying to find everything you guys it's so fun this is like a little magnet that's just extra from Willow Nook Box. It says, Autumn is my cozy season. Look at that sweater. And it's just like a little magnet. That's super cute. I'm like trying to collect all of the extra items that she has for us because, oh, I found, I think I found the drying rack. Here it is. It was along the side of the box. It was hiding from me. So here it is. Oh, is this it? Yes dried herbs and flowers oh my gosh now you guys know I am not normally a sign girl but I think that this is a useful this is a functional sign so I'm more okay with this so this is from spirit of equinox dried herbs and flowers and then it just has some little twine and you can just put your bundles and have them hanging down that's so smart so that has a $14 value it's just like a press board but I think that could look really, really cool. Again, in an entryway or in your kitchen. I actually really like that. That's really neat. Um, so you don't just have random bundles hanging on nails in various places. This is just makes it very, very clear. And it gives you that sort of modern farmhouse rustic look if that's your vibe. So that is cool. All right, so we did find that. We're back on track. Now we have, this is super cute. We have a wax warmer and it looks like a house, you guys. So. This has a $20 value. Oh my gosh, there's a lot. Of, that's where the styrofoam was coming from, obviously. So let me uh, see if I can get it out without too much uh, craziness happening. Okay, so here's the lid. <laughs> here's the lid, but the styrofoam that it was uh, cradled in definitely had, was a casualty of shipping. Oh my goodness, this is so, so beautiful. So, and simple and like, sort of neutral so here's the little back where you're gonna put your little tea light in there and then this is the top where you're gonna put your wax melts in and then you can put this little lid on and have the fragrance come out and there's little holes so that it's gonna get enough air there's holes here in these windows and then of course up here and in these chimneys so that you're gonna get that fragrance coming out into your house that is so so cute and I think it's cute enough to have out year round as well even though it does kind of have a holiday Hugo vibe to it so this has a $20 value like I said and then of course she couldn't leave us hanging so she gave us these amazing uh, sugar and spice company nutty pecan waffle wax melts they came in this little package they have a value of let's see Let's see, they have a value, there's two ounces worth of $8, but like, I gotta, I gotta open them up to show you because they're so, so cute. So they took the time to make these amazing little molds. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna make such a mess. Definitely glad I had that. I'm <laughs> definitely glad that I had the little tray there. So I'm gonna show you, there's a little waffles. There's several little waffles and pumpkins. And then look at these pecans, like they look so realistic. Aren't those amazing? I don't know if they're focusing, but that is so cute. We got a lot of the waffles. Oh my gosh, those are like, it's that super sweet, like fall scent, which like I can only do a little bit of, but look how nice it is because I can sort of decide how much I wanna put in there um, to have that fragrance. There's like little pumpkins. That is so cute. They're, <laughs> they smell pretty good. Ah, oh, that's adorable. I almost wanna like keep them out so you could see them, right? So. You could probably do that. You could probably put them like in a little organza bag and have them be a sachet if you do like that really sweet classic fall scent. All right, we got something from JNL Naturals, which you guys know I love them. They have very simple packaging, but this is a bath and body product, I am assuming. And so I need to use my little slicer to get into it. So what do we get from JNL Naturals? It is the Timeless Face Mask, four ounces, $30 value. So I think uh, after the recipe stand, this is the highest value. That's cool. JNL actually put a little free lip balm extra coupon in there. So this is their timeless face mask. It comes with a little wooden scoop. It comes in this nice little carton. So let's see. Sometimes uh, it's just a powder usually that you then have to mix up with something. So it says, yeah, it's got kaolin clay, bentonite clay, green clay, rasul clay, cocoa powder, green tea powder. And then it says that it is consciously created. And I'm trying to see if it has the directions 
for us on here, but usually you just add like a little bit of water to it. Let me see if it's, sometimes there's like a little bag inside. Let me see. Uh, I, of course I don't want it, if it is loose. Yeah. Oh, did you guys see the puff of clay? Yes, it's loose. I'm going to close that back up <laughs> and uh, look up the directions later. Just a little bit of moisture. You can make it thicker or thinner, whatever you prefer. And then, of course, we have that uh, cinnamon roll print, which is so beautiful. She doesn't even put a price on that, and I feel like she should because that's one of those priceless original pieces of work, of artwork that I think is so unique to the box. So it's one of the priceless items, so add that to the, to to the tally. And it is printed on nice cardstock. Then we have, let's see, it says a wax warmer kit, a ceramic, oh, I think this is what this is, a wax warmer kit. So all these little extras, ceramic tea light spoon, rustic matches in a corked jar, and two tea lights. So a value of $8 so that you can start melting those amazing wax melts right away. Look how cute that there's a little kit that she put together. So yes, we have a couple of tea lights so you can get going on that. And then what else do we have? I have to make a mess because that's what I do. And then everything's all wrapped up in paper here. So then we have, she's so good about wrapping things so that they come in good, good measure. Oh my gosh. So it's like a little pot for your actual tea lights to protect anything. If you have it on a different surface, that's super duper cute. You could probably actually like wax, uh, melt waxes in there as well. And then here are our matches. So again, it came with two tea lights, um, the ceramic tea light spoon, and rustic matches. Oh, these are gorgeous. Look at the match stick part of them in that color. That's really pretty, like super full. Um, those are lovely to have out next to things too, right? So that would be really cute next to your little house uh, for your wax warmer. So cute, just to remind people that you can actually light that, uh, light one of the candles that's inside of it. And then finally, it says we have, oh, to go along with our face mask. I didn't open things in the right order, you guys. We have a cute little uh, face mask kit. So it's a spa headband and a clay mask brush. I don't know where the brush is. Oh, she bundled it all together for us. So that is so smart. And again, she did it for, for the Willow Netbooks. She, she like kind of bundled all this together for us. I love that. That's such, such, so much nice extra thought that went into that. I think that's stuck on there. I think there's like tape in there to keep it from sliding out, but I'm going to slide it out anyway. <laughs> Let me see if I can open this up. Okay. There we go. Yes, indeed. So we had a little sticker there. Come on. So we got this cute little brush and this is like the kind of brush that you could actually keep out. I love that because I always have a little bit of difficulty with my dry face masks when I'm usually too lazy to do them. That's why I like sheet masks so much. But here's the scoop that came from JNL Naturals. And then this is so great because it's an applicator and I love that it's like a brush. Um, sometimes we get the silicone ones, but this just like looks fancier and you can feel really fancy and get some of that f fun skincare feeling going on when you're applying it to your face. And she included as part of that little kit she included this little headband, which I have seen these before. We've gotten them before. I don't mind a little bow. I hope this fits my giant head. Oh yeah, it'll probably fit my head. It'll really keep my hair back though, but it is pretty stretchy. But I love, you guys know, I love when uh, boxes choose neutrals or your classic gray or black instead of super girly pink or bright florals. I mean, I'm wearing like a bright floral right now, but you know what I mean? Sometimes it's nice to not necessarily to get your like girliness on and do a nice luxurious uh, face mask, but and be girly with a big plush bow, but not necessarily in pink. I don't know. It just this feels a little bit more neutral to me. So, wow, this box was packed full of stuff. So I am amazed. You guys, if you haven't gotten in on it, like this box was only $99. You could potentially get $10 off. It includes free shipping. Think of all the re-giftable items in here if you don't have a space for every single thing in your home. But it's also such a nice treat and a way to slip into fall. So we got our wooden recipe stand, the one that likes to make a lot of noise over here. We got that, which is going to look so great with our recipe card which I still haven't taken out of the plastic because I can't yet. Sorry about that reflection, you guys. We got our herb and flower drying rack sign. Super duper cute. You can hang that up. I absolutely love this little basket that it looks like a mess right now because I have all those wax melts in there. The little extras like the acorns and the pumpkin. She didn't even put that on there, you guys. 
that will go perfectly in my little house for uh, melting wax. She gave us the whole kit with the tea lights and the matches. And then for your self-care, we got our JNL face mask with the face mask kit, including the headband and the applicator. And then of course, we got the little fun extra of a little magnet with a, with a sweater on it, you guys. This box was fantastic. Like I said, definitely check it out if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching my video. I would truly appreciate a comment, a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. And I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.